Hey everyone, welcome back to my 100 baby challenge. We are right back in. Oop, there's a welcome wagon. We are right back into this challenge, right where we ended in the last episode. The last episode was more of an introduction episode. I kind of ex explained how I wanted to do the challenge. I wanted to start in a tiny home, kind of explained a little bit about her. Right now, I just wanted to go over the fact that I realized in the last episode that she is on short lifespan because I am doing a legacy challenge on short lifespan. And I just wanted to see if you guys wanted me to keep her on short lifespan or I could just change her to the normal lifespan. That's what's actually said to do in the challenge. But I don't mind an added challenge. I think it makes things interesting. So if anyone has an opinion, let me know in the comments below. If you guys like this challenge or want to see more of it please subscribe please like this video please comment any opinions any ideas go ahead and let me know if you have any baby dads you want to add to this i would be more than happy to add more men into the world to make this challenge easier i also would uh love feedback um as i said before i'm gonna go ahead and have her try to finish her garden salad that she had started and get her cooking skill up, and then maybe she, cooking is delectable. Flip those flapjacks, toss the sauce. Ashlyn is in her element. Does she want to gobble up this opportunity to embrace that she likes cooking? Yes, I would love you to like cooking because you're gonna have to do a lot of it in this challenge. So anyways, um, I don't know if I'm gonna even, I'm gonna cancel this welcome wagon. I know that it's a chance to meet people, but I have a lot to do. I wanna get her cooking skill up. I wanna get her painting skill up. I need her to go out and start meeting people. I need her to garden. I have a lot to do. I am sorry, neighbors. I don't know how long I'm gonna even be here. So, ooh, not more magical plants. Uh, let's do herbs, flowers fruits and vegetables you go ahead and finish your garden salad you don't really need to eat right now so I'm gonna have you just start prepping a little bit of food oh she already wanted to paint what are her whims she wants to do something romantic discuss color theory at a museum no thank you and play an instrument no I'm not buying an instrument I will go ahead and I'm gonna have her open all of these and then I'm gonna have her start her garden and paint and cook and then we are gonna go out on the town so let's get this going I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try doing one of each for now you're an outcast, you're dastardly, deeds have alienated you from polite society. We don't care about all that. No, we can't have a job, so no. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put one of each of these. Um, that's a flower. She's leveled up her cooking, that is amazing. Um, she's gonna do her, do I have anything else? All right, here's a bell pepper, here's a mushroom potato I know a lot of these aren't going to make a ton of money I'd like to eventually get some dragon fruits but I don't see anything here right now so I am gonna go ahead and just have her plant these Ooh, sage too actually if any of you knows the answer to this let me know um, sage is a year-round um, I think it's a vegetable and if you are able to plant sage and then graft everything to sage, does that make the stuff that you've grafted to sage year round as well? I haven't quite figured that out yet. If you know, let me know because I've always been interested in that. Okay, most of the stuff we got is pretty cheap. So hopefully I can get some better vegetables here. I have some space for some more. I have like a few more slots. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and have her plant all this. Her social's down, she needs to go to the bathroom. So I'm gonna go ahead and power through this and have her plant everything, water everything, and then we are gonna go out and meet some people. All right, so she just finished up her gardening. I'm gonna have her, ooh, sell her small classic painting right now. 
it's worth a hundred so she doubled her money and she's hungry as well and she's in need of social so perfect timing I might go ahead and just have her eat a few things in her inventory I know that uh, they don't love this it's always just okay but it doesn't give them a bad moodlet so there we go and it's brought up her hunger just a bit I'll have her eat um, one more banana or plantain I should say and then we are gonna leave we're gonna go travel I think we are gonna go to the Blue Velvet nightclub also if anybody has some cool lots they'd like to share with me I would I would be more than happy to put those inside my world as well because more fun places means more places to meet new people all right it is dead who's this Katrina Katrina Caliente all right Ooh, who's this? Raphael Hackett. Let's go ahead and do a friendly introduction with him. Oh, and who is this? Dominic Fires. Okay, and we're gonna do friendly introduction to him. Is there anybody upstairs? What is she doing? Why can't she talk? Friendly. Oh, she's gonna talk to him first. Okay, friendly to him. Ooh, a lot of people are starting to show up. I have asked her like five times to introduce herself and it is just not working. Okay, come and say hi to him. What's his name? I wonder if, I'm not very familiar with all the townies, maybe just the famous ones, so I don't know if he's a townie to be honest. Okay, now you know him. Ask about day, Let's get to know. He's kind of cute. Is there anybody here? Weston Strait, Simeon Silver Sweater, Paka. Who is he? Oh, he's cute. Oh, he's going to be another. Oh, Grover Hackett and Raphael Hackett. I'm going to just do a little cheat and look at MC Command Center. They live in Sand Trap Flat. They have no spouses, so maybe they're brothers. Yeah, maybe they're brothers. Oh, maybe they're twins. Because look, they're the exact same age. Okay. I'm not super familiar with the townies. So if they are a normal townie, sorry. <laughs> I know only like the really famous ones. Oh, you're going to meet. Friendly, friendly introduction. Oh, she is angry. Oh, he's so cute. Ask about day. Ask if single. Ask if single. He is single. Can we flirt? Oh, he liked it. Um, compliment appearance, and then I'm going to have him exchange numbers. Ah, he's working, though. He liked that. Oh, there's some. Okay, we got some. Uh, we got some romance with him. Perfect. Let's flirt a little bit. Uh, let's use a pickup line. Oh no, he didn't like it. He didn't like it. Is it because we're talking to so many people? Ugh, I hate when when they have a conversation with everybody. Ooh. He, she wants to send a flirty text. Um, let's do a friendly. Ask about love life. I wonder if I can take a photo with him. Let me take a photo with him. No, not of. I want to take a photo with. Take a photo with Grover Hackett. Oh, I wish he wasn't the bartender. Let's see if she's able to take the photo. Okay, perfect. Oh my goodness, she looks so pretty. Okay, let's take these photos. He's cute too. I bet they would have a cute baby. Let's find out. Okay. Oh, let's see, what's their relationship like now? Okay, um, 
I'm gonna do another couple friendly re uh, interactions and then I am going to compliment his appearance. Hopefully I can at least, oop, sorry guys. I hate when they're backwards to each other. Maybe I can get a, uh, a first kiss. No, I don't. All right, let me see if I can build up their, ah, there's no first kiss yet. Ah, compliment his appearance. All right, I'm gonna add him. Oh, I can't add him to a uh, group because he's he's working. There's no aunt, there's no option for first kiss. I'm wondering if it's because I've been trying to build up his. Uh oh. Oh no no no, <laughs> that's going bad. I'm wondering if it's because he's working right now. Ah. I wonder if I can travel with him. Let me see if I can travel with him and get out of here because I've been trying to build up. Yes, I'm gonna travel with him because I've been trying to build up my relationship with him, but I haven't had any option to, for first kiss and I think it's because he's working and there's too many people around. So I'm gonna go ahead and take him home. Here we are. I'm gonna pause this for a second. Let me take a look at him. Okay, and let us blow a kiss. I'm gonna build up our relationship a little bit more and and our our friendly relationship and our romantic relationship. And then, um, oh, now that, see? I'm thinking it totally was because he was working. All right, we're gonna try for first kiss. We're gonna try for first kiss. Oh, hopefully it works, hopefully it works. Ah, I missed the screenshot. Let me see if I can get them to kiss so I can get a cute photo. More choice, kiss, okay. She's talking about moving. I don't know why he's thinking of a ring or was that her? Okay, you guys. Ooh, she just had a, a whim on her own. Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead, try for baby. See if this works. Oh wait, I need to move that out of the way because I think it's gonna block their, their view. All right, are they gonna try? Try for baby with Grover. Let's see if it works. All right, I'm gonna give them some privacy. Do I hear the music? Yep, I'm hearing the music. Break out the candles. Break out the candles, make it romantic. Ashlyn is about to woohoo for the first time. Let's see if it results in a baby. The first baby of the challenge, oh my gosh. Wow, I can't believe it's happening. Oh, 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 didn't mean that for them to fall asleep. I need you to get up, get up, because I need you to see if you have a baby. Let's see if you're pregnant. Wait, wait, I wanna, I wanna take a picture for the first, first pregnancy test of the challenge. Please be pregnant, please be pregnant. Yay! Eating for two. Congratulations, Ashlyn is expecting. There's going to be a new addition to the household. Yay! Is she gonna tell him? Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Aw, oh, I'm kind of sad because he's so nice. And it was so easy with him. I feel so bad that like, Oh, and he's eating our food though. And she wants to ask him to be a, her boyfriend. Aw. Well, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to do something a little bit different. I'm gonna have her go ahead and ask to cool off their romantic relationship. Mm, ask to be, just to be friends. Hopefully he doesn't get mad. Oop, I keep on grabbing those. They're eating together. Aw. Oh. <laughs> Honestly, if this was another, aw. Oh. Okay, now their romance bar is gone. If this was another challenge, though, 
I would definitely ship them. I would definitely want them to be in a relationship. Oh, kind of makes me a little bit sad now. She's super flirty. Well, I'm going to send him home so she can get some sleep. I don't know. Oh, I feel so bad. Okay, you need to go to sleep now. Goodbye. Goodbye forever. Well, Grover. Grover Hackett. He was the first baby da daddy of the challenge. We will miss you. Look at him leaving. He probably has to go back to work. He's in his <laughs> mixologist bartender uniform. Goodbye, Grover. Maybe we'll bring you when the baby's born. Let's let her sleep. Okay, she is awake. And she is, she has morning sickness. She needs a shower. And, ooh, she has a sore back from a cheap bed. Oh, I'm sorry. Can she, like, upgrade this? Once she's better, I'm going to see if she's able to upgrade it. But I think for some reason, um, I think she has to have a certain level of handiness to upgrade the bed. So let's build that up. That will be fun. All right, I'm going to have her finish taking her shower. Ooh, earbuds have been added to Ashlyn's inventory. You can use them while she's active. I didn't even know that. Okay. I didn't even know that's how you got them. I always wondered how you got earbuds. All right, I'm going to clean these up. No, 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 no. Don't. Don't clean that up. I want to make money on it. Let's look. She is in her first, second trimester is in 17 hours. Go ahead and clean that up. Can you upgrade? No, you need level six handiness and level eight handiness. Ooh. Okay, so I got to remember that. I'm wondering if I should just get her a better bed since she has a sore back. Eh, it's fine. She's going to just have to deal with it for now. We need, to, we need to start saving up money. I'm going to have her come and uh, harvest all. And I think she just can harvest right now. I'm going to have her come tend to her garden. I'm going to have her do a medium classic painting. And then I'm going to have her cook a party size grilled cheese and hopefully not burn down the house. And then let's see, has she met anyone else? Oh my gosh, she has negative relationships with her neighbors. I guess that's not great. Oh, I really want to know if Raphael Hackett and Grover Hackett are like brothers or family members. Is it terrible if that's the, if he's the second baby daddy? Ooh, I don't know if that's too scandalous. We'll find out. <laughs> we'll find out before I go there. So, <clears throat> sorry, my voice is doing that thing again. Ooh, self-sufficiency is in the lead. Please proceed to your nearest voting. Okay, okay, oh, let's vote, let's vote. I want self-sufficiency. I'm gonna have her stop this really quick. I really want self-sufficiency because, oh, she has 32, so clean air, self-sufficiency, so. Okay, hopefully that's that way because, um, it, you'll get points through fishing, gardening, and handiness. And I really, really want a green neighborhood because everything gets better. I even think gardening gets better. Everything's better when it's green, in my opinion at least. So hopefully we can get that. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to have her finish her painting. Aw, I heard there's someone famous at the lounge. Want to check it out? No, Grover. I'm sorry. You're cute, but... I have a challenge and I just, I can't even think about relationships right now. Too much to do, so little time. Okay, again, I think I'm gonna end this here. I'm having her build up her painting skill right now. Hopefully I can get her to build up her cooking skill and her gardening skill. She still can't water anything. Again, if you guys want me to keep her at short lifespan, I will love to do that. I think we talked about that. I think we talked about how I realized she was at short, short lifespan. I would keep her at short, li short lifespan if that's what you guys would want. It might be fun. I do want to kind of take her, take her days back though. For some reason, I don't see that option right now. She still only has 10 days until she ages up. 
So she lost about two days before I started this challenge, probably during the play testing and everything when I was building. So I'm gonna find a way to gain two days in this lifespan and I can either just bump her back up to normal or I can keep her at short. I'm sorry if I keep repeating myself. Took out the wonderful whims mod because it was messing with the challenge and I was having trouble figuring out how to change all the settings. I'm gonna see if I can figure out how to change them to where it won't be so hard. But if you guys want me to add that, that back in, I don't mind. It'll just make things a little harder. Oh, poor girl, she's sick. Well, I'm gonna leave this here. She's pregnant with first baby. She is, let's look at her skills. I'm gonna sell that. She has just under $600. Well, now she has 729. She has her little garden set up. She is at skill wise. She has, ooh, she's low on the, I want to get her charisma skill up because that helps. She's at level three of cooking, level two of gardening, level three of painting. I don't believe she even has a handiness skill yet, but I want her to gain that. Um, maybe I'll get her, once we have some more money, I'll get her the table. I can't remember what it's called, the craft table or something that will help with handiness. If you guys have any ideas, any suggestions, any tips, tricks, whatever, please let me know in the comments. If you're enjoying this challenge, please like this video. If you wanna continue watching, please subscribe. That will help me out a lot. I love, love hearing from you. If you guys have any baby dads they want me to add in, let me know. Uh, we can pick a uh, hashtag if you'd like. I'm Sim Sims Endeavor on the gallery. Sims Endeavor is kind of a long name, but just let me know. And I any hashtag you put it under or what your name is, I will look for it. I will add them in. If you have any lots or any places, uh, let me know. I am going to continue building everything up here. And as soon as she has the baby, I'm really hoping, really, really hoping it's only one baby because I really don't have a lot of room for another baby. Please only be one baby. I'm going to leave this here. I really am having fun with this. And I hope that we are able to get a lot done in the next episode. And I'm rambling. <laughs> Sorry. I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Have a good day.